It is true that we cannot fully predict what effects chemotherapy will have, both in terms of its effectiveness and its side effects. Of course, statistics exist. Data describing how effective a particular chemotherapy drug tends to be and how often certain side effects occur. Physicians use these statistics when counseling patients about treatment and, at times, when deciding whether a patient is eligible for a given regimen. For example, if a specific drug is known to cause significant lung toxicity, it may be avoided in patients who already have impaired lung function. Bleomycin, the B in the ABVD regimen used to treat Hodgkin lymphoma, is a well-known case. Because of its potential for pulmonary toxicity, bleomycin has been omitted from many newer regimens, such as nivolumab AVD and brentuximab AVD. Still, perfect prediction for an individual patient is impossible. That is why oncologists carefully and continuously monitor patients during treatment. The more experienced the oncologist, the more familiar they are with a drug's potential toxicities, how to manage them, and how to recognize whether a symptom truly represents a side effect. If adverse effects arise, the medical team does everything possible to minimize them. When the expected benefit clearly outweighs the side effects, treatment is continued. Ultimately, the key to a successful treatment plan lies in ongoing communication between you and your oncologist, discussing goals of care, possible side effects, and your personal definition of quality of life. Each patient's tolerance for risk, perception of benefit, and sense of what constitutes quality of life are unique. It is therefore essential that your oncologist fully understands your wishes. Remember, chemotherapy is not a one-size-fits-all journey. What matters most is constant communication with your medical team and understanding your own body. Stay informed, stay hopeful, and take each step with confidence. For more Real Cancer Insights, don't forget to like and subscribe.